Let's do a crystallization. A crystallization is a method of separating a solid that is in solution through the formation of crystals. A crystal is an arrangement of atoms, molecules or ions in the three directions of space. A crystalline solid is one whose particles form crystals and, in addition, have a regular external shape, such as cubes, prisms, needles, etc. Many minerals are formed by crystallization. Add some water to a beaker. Add copper to sulfate to the water. A lot of quantity, a lot. The more you add, the more likely it is that crystals will form. Don't worry, most of the solute is recovered. Stir with a rod, although it dissolves little. The rest will dissolve on heating. Take the container to the microwave. and put it inside. Preheat for about three minutes. Meanwhile, cut a piece of thread. and tie it to a glass rod. The thread will serve as a condensation nucleus for some crystals. Continue heating on an electric stove until boiling. The process takes most, more than half an hour. The solubility curve of a substance is the graph that represents solubility versus temperature. Solubility is the concentration of a saturated solution. Most of these curves are upward. This means that the higher the temperature, the greater the solubility. If a lot of solute is dissolved at high temperature and then cooled down, there will be an excess of solid that will precipitate as crystals. When half the solvent evaporates, stop heating. Carry the beaker to a table. Place the rod with the thread on top and let it cool for 24 hours. Next day, the thread has stuck to the crystals at the bottom because the thread was too long. Pour the solution into a bottle. And you can already see the crystals at the bottom. Try to remove the crystals from the bottom, but they are stuck. Finally, it comes out. Dry it. And here you are, an artificial mineral.